Hello and welcome back to Let's Try. I am uh, going through a bunch of demos for the Steam Next Fest, and this is one of them Geo Depths. Um, this sounds like kind of like a 3D um, Super Motherload, I think it was called, or just Motherload, uh, which is a game I, I played a long time ago uh, back in the Flash days. But uh, it's uh, you know digging, mining, upgrade your drill kind of kind of business, and it sounded appealing to me. I like this kind of game and I don't think that there's enough of these kind of games that um, really hit the right notes. I've, I've played a few of them and they can be really fun or they can be really dull. I think like, you know, um, when ter something like Terraria started initially, it, it felt like that kind of game and then it went very kind of Metroidvania and like became basically a toy box. But I really do appreciate a good old fashioned digging game. I'm going to go ahead and see if do we have uh do we have uh, reverse invert y-axis? No, we don't. Oh, please. No. No. Ah, my kryptonite. All right, well, I guess I'm gonna have to just deal. This is gonna mess up my, my whole day, honestly. Um, I like, uh, I like, you know, like Deep Rock Galactic is another good example of this kind of the kind of game although i feel like for me personally i think that deep rock galactic went a little bit left for dead in its methods I, I guess we can't interact with that i'm not sure what we're interacting with here this is a blind play and this game is probably early and this is just the demo so all of those i uh, just want to check all those boxes can drill through rock deep underground in order to mine ore and find caves upgrades and tools are available upon research and discovery Multi-tool. Find and collect any resources you find. Scan and any curiosities you may come across in caves. Upgrade your drill in order to be, uh, to be able to explore easier. Build up your hu hub home base. Investigate any wrecks you find. Okay. Still not seeing anything that we can interact with. Teleport ready. Please step inside. Okay. Woo! Okay. I know it's early, but I will say these uh, these uh, graphics feel a little bit unrefined. I'm not judging just yet. Some of them are nice. Drill storage. Hub home base. Undock. Okay, let's undock. What is, what is happening? Enter. Okay. This is, this is novel. So we can, uh, we have a, like a completely different kind of interface. And we're digging into the earth. But hold on, what was that? Undiscovered. Can we can we do something with this? Unable to dock. Can we open the door? Dock. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what we're doing here. I don't necessarily want to dock, but I do want to get resources, don't I? Or do we have to scan that? Hub undiscovered ore. Cave. Cave unvisited. Wreck. Oh, I see. We're being pointed to certain things. So how does how does one? Uh... Oh, we can back up. I didn't realize. Can we? Okay, we we push that. Oh, what are we doing here? Okay, so this is how we mine. I thought there was going to be kind of like three D interaction but um i might be mistaken about that well anyway we're 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 going for now i'm seeing some uh undiscovered ore over here yeah okay i'm surprised our radar is so good it seems like the kind of thing that you would want to uh have the player up upgrade over time 
Okay, so we're grabbing some ore. We've got eight undiscovered ores. We could, uh, let's uh, maybe head back to home base and see if we can scan those. Okay. So now we'll dock, I think. Offload. So there's the, uh, there's the ore we just mined. This, it's kind of dark in here. Oh, what, what, what is that business? Is that where we mined? Can walk in this. It, it doesn't seem to hurt us. Not sure if that's the direction that we mined. I don't, I don't know. There's, I have lots of questions. All right, so we're uh, system off. We want to turn that on, maybe. We don't have a lot of energy. Hub power. Are we about to run out of power? Scan or to unlock research. How do we do that? Scan. So we're scanning that ore, and it turns to be it turns out turns out to be iron ore. Refine into iron. Scan ore to unlock research. Well, I'd like to do I'd like to turn that into something. Oh, here we go. Refine. So we have a certain amount of energy, and it seems to me that we are burning through our energy. But we are refining our ore. I do kind of like the, uh, I don't know what to call it, the way that the line lines are defined in this game. It makes things readable, but not distracting. All right, so we're refining iron. I thought that we were running out of power, but it seems like we're okay. No resources to scan, so we're just, uh, we're just refining ore. That's what it's getting refined into. Maybe, um... Uh, scan ore to unlock research. I'm wondering if we can use any of this ore to upgrade our resources. Are we out of room? No, it's just, it's taking a while to refine. Alright, I'm gonna leave it for now, and I guess we'll continue... Um, getting some resources. So let's go, let's go in the other direction. I'm not sure, uh, like, you know, what kind of decisions are we making in this game? Is it just like the direction? Oh, okay. We can't go through that, I guess. Uh, is it just like the direction we're, we're mining in? Um, are there hazards? There seems to be a cave to our south. Maybe we could check that out. Maybe we can mine, um, you know, without our machine. We can, we can get out of our machine and check out a cave or something. Well, there's some resources. Oh, you only need to click it. You don't need to hold it down. Okay. I want to go to that cave over to our uh, south. We can get through this darker material, just not any darker than that. Let's, uh, what is this? We can't, we don't have any other mechanical parts just yet. We have some more ore. Let's grab that ore. We do have a certain amount of space in our, uh, our mining drill. Cave, okay, Lumen Globe. Can we, um, dock here? Yes. Let's check this out. Really have uh, any way any light? Do I have anything? I you know pressing buttons. Okay, we have a light. Can I grab this? No. So what am I doing? So some interesting ideas here, but I'm not sure uh, what it, how it's coalescing. 
There's a cool cave here. I can sprint. There's a cool cave here, but like, uh, what is it doing for me? We can jump. I can't even jump across this chasm. I wonder if there are like enemies planned in this game. I can't grab these plants. I can't really grab anything. So I'm just kind of wandering around in this cave and there doesn't seem to be much to do here. I'm wondering, uh, I'm wondering if maybe this game needed some more time in the oven before it was made available. No, no offense at all. Like I'm liking what I'm seeing here, but there doesn't seem to be a lot of game here just yet. So let's uh, let's see what we can upgrade on our drill. I feel like that's gonna definitely set the bar in terms of like what the gameplay loop is maybe maybe i just got unlucky with a, a bad cave maybe some caves are more interesting than that this is undiscovered ore so we could definitely check that out oh some some ores need to be dug with different uh multiple tiles okay we have another one of those Okay. All right, we can uh, we can head back now. So that cave I, I see is uh, highlighted. Does that just mean we discovered it, or does it mean that we explored it? Does it mean we we got everything that we could get out of it? I have lots of questions. I think this game it's it's one of those games where it has uh, you know it's got potential, but uh, I don't yet know what it's striving for just yet. So we've got new ores. These are just going to go through. They don't need to be scanned. But those new ones at the back there, those are going to be scanned. Okay, we have we have things to re unlock now. Uh, hub construction one unlocks hub construction, allowing the expansion of your base. Use your multi tool to start building. Press F. Do I have I have a multi tool? Okay, we have uh, new things. Oh, what is this? This seems like uh, stuff, mechanics. We have enough con to construct an extra room. Okay, now now we got something going on. We need more iron for this. Inventory terminal. Or, ooh, a refinery. So that looks to be like we could have a second refinery if we want. Or we could remove, what, what would happen? If we remove this new room, would we get our materials back? Yes. If we add more copper... Oh, we don't have any copper because I haven't refined it yet. So that's what we just got. Let's go ahead and refine everything. Okay, so I, that, you know, there's something, there's something here. So I haven't yet figured everything out. Let's see what else we got here. We need more research. Basic power management unlocks the power terminal, power battery, and biofuel generator. Unlocks drill upgrades to be performed at the drill upgrade terminal. Allows you to decorate your base with some furniture. Scan ore and cave discoverables to gain research points. Well, uh, do we have a scanner? Where's our scanner? 
Okay, let's uh let's have a look at the keybinds. Mult uh, run multi tool. So maybe the multi tool is the scanner. Um, don't know. I don't know. I do not know. I am unaware. I am lacking the necessary information. I am requiring need to know information. All right, let's carry on these wayward sons. Um, let's check out a, well, there's a wreck. Iron ore, copper ore. We have copper ore, plenty of copper ore. No, never mind. There is not a lot of copper ore. We're going to have to dig quite deep for it. What we want is undiscovered ore. Not really seeing anything. So why don't we go for copper ore over to our northwest. I can definitely see um, some drill upgrades being like a very, uh, you know, uh, needed thing. Like right now it takes a long time to get to where we want to go. I like, I, I kind of like this, re this uh, interface. But I do think that it would be nice to have a little bit more, I don't know, visual to this. Because this uh, this feels a little dig dug, if you know what I mean. Feels a little Atari. I think that um, this is nice, but we could definitely do better. Honestly, we could even just like go full 3D and like you scan in a direction kind of thing. Or maybe this map could be um you know a small portion of the interface and we also have like a 3d kind of first person you know screen for the drill maybe that's something you can even like upgrade into you know uh is that new oof no that's iron I, I like this kind of game um, You know, I like I like a base builder. I think that um, a trend I've been very unhappy with tr In terms of the base builder is that, like it feels like every base builder needs to be a survival game And I kind of hope they don't go that direction with this because I, I really like I know some people like to To keep their dude fed and watered, but I, I really really don't like those kind of mechanics. I find them really tedious I'm much more about like the exploration and uh you know looking for resources upgrading stuff i like digging games that incorporate those kind of things um i think they can be a lot of fun okay so we can't get that last resource below us let's um well we're almost our inventory is almost full oh god But it'd be nice to check out something. Is there any undiscovered ores up here? No. It doesn't look like it. It says, okay, it does say that there is one, but it's quite a bit northwest. Well, if I'm, if I'm going to go, I may as well go. I mean... Anywhere I dig is going to be valuable because it's not going to take me so long to get here the next time. Oh, it looks like that's in the dark dirt, so I, I'm not going to be able to get to that. So, never mind. I'm assuming wrecks are going to be something that we want. I want some copper. Yeah, I feel like the scanner is something that you should unlock. Like, I think at first you might not even, you shouldn't even have a scanner. You should just like have to kind of dig blind. Oh, there's another copper. Also good, just gonna like turn that off. 
Oh, okay. So we're we're done there. I'm hoping that that ore like is not wasted. Like it'll be there waiting for me. All right, so we're gonna make our way back home. It's a little awkward. Um, like, can I do WASD? No, you. They really want you to interact with the steering wheel with the mouse, and that's fine. Um, maybe, maybe they, you can unlock quality of life features later. I don't know what, uh, like, there doesn't seem to be any... Wait, what? Oh, we didn't refine our copper? I guess that would be the good reason to have a second refinery, is that you can have two resources being refined at once. Um, I don't know if there's any, like, downside to leaving our machines just working. Can't research anything because we didn't get any new resources. I do. I, what I should do is check out that cave again and see if I can scan stuff. The inventory terminal. I'm not sure what this is going to be for, but I wouldn't mind checking it out. We already have a research terminal. We don't. I don't think we have an inventory terminal, so we can make that now. That just shows us what we've got. Show me what we've got. Oh, we can make, oh, we need biomass. Okay, so we're gonna, that's what those plants in the cave were for. Okay. Okay, I, I've, I'm starting to, I'm starting to see. Um, can we get a second refinery? We don't have enough copper. We will have enough copper when I come back though. And again, I would want a second refinery so that I can uh, basically leave a bunch of things smelting. So yeah, um, I think that there is potential here. I I maybe rescind. Is that my rescind? Is that the right word? I. I take back what I said about it being uh, a little early. I do think this game feels early, but I don't think that that, um, I, I think that that might be like a subjective thing. I, I, I am liking these mechanics and I'm liking where we're going with this. And it, you know, after spending a little bit of time in here, I, I do think that it, it does look nice. Okay. So our multi-tool actually has a light. So can we scan stuff? How do we scan? How do we take biomass? How do we do stuff? How do we do anything? I, I'm, I'm glad we have a light. Maybe those lights are what we want. I mean, they, they do seem like something important. Ah. Plant orb. Harvest target. There we go. There we go. Now, now we're cooking with biomass. Now we're doing something. We're definitely doing something of value. I haven't mentioned it, but I do like the music in this game. It's, it's pretty chill. New things to scan. Ro pocket plant. What does this do? Oh, I guess it just gives us uh, research for um, scanning it. Same as this. Cave dandelion. Harvest target. We get some more biomass. I kind of hope that that's not taking up resources, not enough storage. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, uh, yeah, they do take up inventory space in our drill. That's fine. We can scan the biomass and hopefully we've got enough research now that we can actually buy something, uh, of, you know, good value. And I know biomass is important because we're going to be using that for, uh, as fuel. How did I miss this one? I can't grab it now. Uh, 
Uh, you gotta put your multi-tool away to interact with the buttons. I feel like that, you know. Okay, and it's also slower to go backwards than it is to go forward, so you are gonna want to turn around. Maybe it is? I don't know. Our drill is so slow. It's really hard to tell. I, I, I also feel like maybe the sound effects for drilling is a little weak. I don't mean to just like be uh, the backseat uh, developer in this game, uh, you know. I'm just, I guess I'm just like thinking out loud as I play. We've got that biomass. I don't know if, uh, we've got tons of research. Are we going to be able to scan that biomass as well? I guess we know it's biomass, so no. Unlocks the power terminal, power battery, and biofuel generator. Unlocks drill upgrades to be performed at the drill upgrade terminal. Probably we need that. And I won't buy a second refinery until, well, let's, uh, let's at least start some processing. Um, so we need the drill upgrade terminal. Where is that? Where? Oh. Oh, okay. Um, it might mean like literally at the drill. Go check this out. Uh, no. Where is the drill terminal? Hmm. I don't know what the deal is. I would have thought that I would have to build it. Oh, okay, we do. Okay, so those numbers in the bottom right are are uh, were kind of confusing me. Not really the game's fault, um, but I thought that was like the number of things I can build. Not the case. It's um, all it really means is th I can select those with the number keys. So I wonder, is there something else I can build? Doesn't look like it. We could build another refinery. But uh, we're probably going to need resources for drill upgrades. Um, strength seems like a good one. We need 15 iron for that. Mining shape cells. We can increase our capacity. Speed. Speed seems like a good idea, but we really want to do strength, I think, so that we can get to some of the um, further areas. Uh, if we just wait for one more iron then uh pe people get upset when i say iron i don't care though <laughs> um let's upgrade strength and we might have enough iron to uh upgrade something else drill mining shape speed would be really good but we can also unlock other things what is this one allows you to decorate your base with furniture no, biofuel generator seems like a good idea. So yeah, I, I'm getting into this. This is uh, this is good. It's it's not in com like super complex, but you know I'm not that far into the game right now. Uh, power terminal. I need one more iron, so I don't have enough. Unless. Okay, well, uh, yeah, I don't I don't think that there's I think I think I just need one more and then we have decoration. I mean, I don't know if I need any research for anything else. So let's just grab it. I'm sure a more robust tech tree would go a long way for for um, many people, but uh, I don't know, maybe it becomes more robust once you've No, no, that's really it. I might need to uh, scan other things before we can unlock other, uh, you know, new new stuff. So power terminal, power battery. Okay, biofuel generator. Those are exp that's expensive. 
Uh, okay. Lots of new things to upgrade, but we have increased strength. Um, so let's see if we can find some new, a new resource. I wish I'd gotten speed instead, I won't lie. Um, there's a wreck. Kind of want to check out the wreck. That seems interesting to me. Because I, I am, I am interested in what, like, what is the, uh... Is there going to be a story in this game? Can we, can we mine through this now? Yes, we can. Takes a little bit of time, but... I can. I'm going to assume there's going to be limitation. We like we upgraded our strengths, but not by much. We may as well grab some resources while we're uh, making our way. Iron is going to be good. That looks like a cave. But it, it looks like we're being pointed towards the cave, so it might be the wreck is in the cave. So yeah, let's check it out. Oh, uh, yeah, we just leave and dock. We're docking with the cave. We've got some new plants here. We can scan them. I don't know what we're going to be spending that research point on. I don't know if we take damage. Tuber fruit. Harvest target biomass. I'm gonna hold off on grabbing biomass. Okay, here we go. This is our wreck. What is that? Drill tech capsule. Drone drilling. Okay, uh, may maybe that's something we can research now. Very, very light themes here, but I am I'm getting a little tiny bit Subnautica vibes. Subnautica really had quite a large impact. Can we take damage off these? No. Maybe that's something that we will, you know. Again, I, I don't necessarily want to see this game become like yet another survival game, but like I, I do, I see the value in there being hazards. It's exploration. There's, there should... There might be, uh, you know, should be risk, maybe? Uh, oh, right. I, I think that you should have your multi-tool out when you're interacting with stuff. Okay. Um, let's, uh, let's grab some resources while we're here. Iron's gonna be good. We definitely want copper as well. That's, that's good enough. We can maybe grab one more on our way back, but... Uh, I would like to increase our speed. I don't know if we have enough copper. Oh, there we go. We could grab some copper as well. Perfect. I wonder if um, the return rate on, like, breaking down machines is the same as building them. Because then, like, you could be exploitative and, like, build a refinery... Refine your goods and then destroy your refinery. We could try that just as an experiment. I'm not sure what the biomass generator is going to be for. Like, do we need more energy? Curios. Um, let's see if we have more research. Doesn't look like it. 
Um, oh, here we go. Drones. The heck are drones for? Mining drone count. Okay, uh, you can consider my curiosity peaked. Okay, let's see if we can build a refinery. Uh, we don't have enough, but we should have enough soon. It does take quite a long time to refine stuff. I wonder if that's something we can improve in the future. Yo, that takes a long time. I feel like you're not really meant to wait around, though. I think you're supposed to just, like, go on missions often. So, like, we could, you know, let's, let's go and, uh... Find some more iron. We have a stronger drill so we can dig a little bit closer. I think that this is either going to work for some people or not. Um, I think that this like mining mechanic feels a little bit simplistic. Um, I know that there's ways to upgrade it, but it doesn't look, I don't know if there's much, many ways to like make it deeper. I am interested in these drones. I, I am interested in what they, um, inc you know, how they change things or how they improve things, progress things. But I don't know uh, if they're gonna change things like enough I, I guess I'm like, this is the kind of game, it's, it's going to take a while to figure out actually what kind of game it is. Like, is there going to be automation? Um, is there going to be, uh, you know, like... It's really hard to say. It feels early. It feels early, but not necessarily in the sense... You know, like, um, a game that really comes to mind for me is a game like Hydroneer. Uh, if you've ever played Hydroneer, like when you start it, it feels like a very labor intensive game, but it very much becomes about automation. And so in that sense, like you could play the first hour of it and really not understand what kind of game you're actually playing. Um, and this could be the same kind of sense. It could be like, you know, maybe, you know, we get robots and they do all of the mining for us and then it becomes a very different kind of game. Maybe it opens up and becomes something very different. Um, maybe we can like find relics or gems or something and sell them. Maybe uh, there's a crafting element that has yet to be introduced to the game. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm interested. I like what I'm seeing, but I definitely think that there needs to be more to this. Okay, let's... Uh, this might be my last trip, just so uh, we, can, we can check out bots just to see, to see what they introduce to the game. And then um, maybe call it there. Drones, let's let's grab that upgrade. This is a drill upgrade, it must be said. I really hope they just they don't just like auto click on mining like the rocks to mine. That would be like, to, in my opinion, one of the worst ways they could introduce quality of life. So we have drones now. Um, oh, we need to process the our new minerals. We can refine our copper. How much? How much do we have left? Uh, not really enough. We need how much for a refinery? We need five copper, so we don't have enough. Okay, so let's see what let's see what uh, bots add. Um. Okay. What what, what is this button? Drone drilling. Line. Okay, that's actually kind of neat. 
So you can just set a drone out to do some drilling and it'll actually, oh wow, it even like comes back as well. That's actually nifty. That's a, that's a decent way to incorporate that. Now do they, um, how, how far do they dig? Can they dig through this stuff? Yeah, they can. I think you could probably, you can drill with it and uh, it'll, it might speed things up a little bit. Or you could probably just like set it and forget it. Like, you know, set it to drill a, a line um, while you, you know, do other things. Like for instance, check out this cave. New plants. Antenna plant. More research. There needs to be more things to spend research on. This is a very small cave. Not all the caves have to be big. Again, I keep trying to undock while I'm holding my multi-tool. Oh, interesting. So when I entered that cave, I think it just like despawned the, uh, the, the drone. And I'm not sure, I, I guess the drone doesn't actually like get resources, but it looks like if I have more drones then I, it, it gives me more, um, options. Let's see what happens if I do it in a diagonal. Yeah, okay, so there's there isn't really a limitation to how you can use the drones. That's kind of cool. I, I don't like I still think that the game needs more complexity, a bit more depth, no pun intended. But, um, you know, I do I do like the direction. I, I, I think that if we kind of like if they build on this and add more stuff to, to grow into more more things to progress into, um, this could be really cool. I, I, you know, maybe even like to see some automation. Like you have to refine your materials and you do have like built-in conveyor belts, but it might be kind of nice to, to do some of that yourself. It, it seems like they're kind of going that direction because like, oh, do I have more than one drone? Oh, I do have more than one drone. Uh, it seems like, you, you know, you can uh, work on power generation, which seems like a kind of uh, out of nowhere mechanic like why would you care about power generation why how does that um help you in your base so i bet i think you can probably ask them to just come back and when i clicked that it looked like they didn't drill anymore so that's just like a recall button If I if I got another drill, I could probably um, do cone drilling, which would be kind of cool. Okay, we got we got a lot of copper, and uh, since our drones are doing such a nice job, we may as well just kind of follow them home. Nice. Yeah, that definitely speeds things up a bit. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, this is, uh, this is pretty cool. I, I definitely wouldn't want to see more, but you know, like that's not a bad thing. That means like, you know, I am hooked and I'd like to see this progress into something a bit more, you know, refined, no pun intended, <laughs> maybe pun intended a little bit on that one. Um, if we can get one more, you know what? Stop that. We're gonna, we need, um, copper. Wow, stopping takes a while as well. Uh, okay, yeah. Go to copper, give me one more copper, and then I can get a second refinery going. So 
This tells us what we need to refine. Tells us how much biomass we have. Could get another drone. Um, we, if I went through all my materials, I would have enough for it. I think. Maybe. But we have a second refinery now. So let's see if we, like, if I can refine with this now, then that tells me that um, energy doesn't really have that much of a purpose. At least not yet. There's not enough things to spend energy on. Oh, here we go. And it's kind of difficult for me to tell how much energy I'm using. I guess this is where I would want, uh, for instance, the power terminal. Well, am I refining copper in two different machines? I did. I did see for a second there. It told me I, I needed more more power. Oh, cool! If we put it on the ground, it, it gives it a little base. That's a that's a really cool way of doing that, actually. I could I could you know. Okay, so let's do iron ore. This is still working on its last. Yeah, I think if I have more power, these will be faster. I think that's what it means. I don't know. I, I'd like to get a, have a little bit more. Um... Yeah, it, it seems like I'm running into power problems for sure. Let's, let's see for sure. Production, consumption. We don't have any production, but we do have demand. So you know what, let's, let's uh, get rid of that. And see if we can't um, build a reactor. There's a power battery. Oh, we need a lot of iron for a biofuel generator. Shoot. All right. Well, uh, yeah, let's uh, let's call it here. And this may be a game I come back to because, uh, you know, it's it's interesting now, but I think it could be really compelling given a bit more time. Um, if you've played this, this uh, this one is called what is it called? Geo depths. Let me know if in the comments if you've played geo depths and um, you know, if you've enjoyed this video, definitely hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. And I'll see you next time. Take it easy.